The first thing you're going to need to do is you need to go into the Google Player App Store where you can actually see we can get the Venture app. Now, this app doesn't cost any money and you can basically open it just by clicking on open where you want to just sign up with your email or phone number just on the screen right here. In doing so, you'll be brought to this screen right here. Now, this is actually the only app you can buy these bus or train tickets in or you can actually do it in person, but buying it online, you have to get this app. Now, before I show you actually how to buy these tickets, I'm going to show you how to view all of the schedules for every single thing and every single time of stuff leaving. Now, if you go in the search bar up here, you can actually search for every train, bus, and bike that may be departing from this area up here. So you can actually search for Logan Square, let's just say that's where I want to start from, and you can actually search for their next destination on where you want to go to from there and view all the routes on this page. And if there's actually one you're interested in, you can simply click on it. In doing so, you can view the line and how long it will actually take to come but if you'd like to buy a ticket we just need to go back to the home screen right here where you can actually click on the option called buy metro tickets or you can set up your first card if you would like a month pass or a card in doing so you're just going to want to pick your line and you can actually pick the destination on this you can even search for them or add multiple destinations like so in doing so you actually have the option to do one way day pass or a five day pass right here which will actually last for just five days. But in this case, I'm on a one-way one. So I'm gonna go down here and then click on any of these reduced fare options. If you are a student in the military or a elder, you just wanna to go to checkout here and you can actually add tickets if you wanna buy multiple here. And you simply want to add a payment method, otherwise it won't let you check out. In doing so, after you add Apple Pay, new card or a split payment with someone, you click on the purchase option in the bottom middle of the screen. In doing so, your ticket will just show up on this home screen like this one right here, where you click on show and you can actually see your ticket as well as the time right here, which you can show to them on the train. And it's important to note when you actually buy one of these tickets, you can use it on any train or any bus line, but you need to make sure you buy the right train or bus ticket. It doesn't matter where to because they all work on all of the methods of transportation simultaneously, but when you buy one, it actually works for all.